Uh, it's actually a funny story. So when I was in high school, I was actually getting recruited by Todd, our coach at Iona, um, at another university. And um, I ended up not choosing there, but I kept a relationship with Todd uh, for you know, all those years that I was at Rutgers previous to the school. And once I got hurt at Rutgers and was looking for a change to go somewhere else, I actually kept in touch and kept the connection with Todd. And he was able to give me an opportunity five years later. Um, so, you know, I felt really comfortable with him. And when I visited the campus, I hung out with a bunch of the girls and just the team chemistry and camaraderie was just like amazing. And I knew that I wanted to change and I wanted to come to Iona just because when I got to the campus, it just felt right. And yes, ever since then, I've just been really excited to head to campus. Um, I definitely fell in love with soccer at an early age. I was actually a cheerleader in like kindergarten. Uh, my dad was a football coach, so it was easy for my parents for me to be on the sideline um, as a, a toddler all the way through, I think it was second grade. And my dad actually said to me, you know, do you want to cheer for other people or do you want people to cheer for you? And I just will always remember that because like within the next couple of days I had signed up for rec soccer. And ever since then, it's just been my main sport. So I think that's like a funny story. I always tell people when they ask, you know, why did you choose soccer? It was actually my dad was a big influence and I loved it and just kept going with it. And then in high school, it got really serious for me with, you know, going to showcases and college coaches talking to me. and that's when I really wanted to take my game to the next level. Yeah, that, I think my favorite memory was I played on a club team in New Jersey and we would travel all over the country and play games and we actually won our national championship in 2017, oh no, 2015. And um, we were the top team in the nation. I remember just, just feeling surreal when we had won the championships. So I think that's my top memory in my career so far. I think the word culture and a team aspect is, you know, what standards do we hold ourselves to as a team? You know, every team's different. They have different goals, but in the end, it's the goals that your team is trying to reach together. Um, so I think it's the values, the beliefs, the standards that as a team, you know, we have traditions, we have, you know, team bonding sessions that just bring that culture of like what Iona soccer is. And everyone needs to buy into that or else, you know, not just our team, but no team will be successful if you don't buy into the culture. And I think the standards that we have for this upcoming season, I mean, Todd has changed the program and has won more games than they ever have before. And I think the girls are really buying into the culture and the fact that we actually can win a MAC championship. So I think that the culture is like super amazing this year. And it's for me as a new player, the girls have been so welcoming and everyone's buying into the idea that, you know, we're going to win this year and uh, practices have been going well. And just that culture, that team aspect has been super cohesive with the freshmen and including me being a graduate student. Um, I don't really have go to songs. It's just, you know, whatever's pumping me up at the moment. Um, it really just depends. But um, I think that's one of my rituals is like before a game, I just have my headphones on and I'm just like blasting music and that's what really gets me pumped up. But usually whatever is, you know, I'm feeling whatever comes out in the spring, I know I'll definitely be jamming out to that. Mm -hmm. um, I'm definitely looking at just, you know, starting with this group of girls, like it's a new team for me, a new environment. And it's just, you know, it, it's just, the girls have been so welcoming and I'm just so excited to just get out there and compete with them um, because I know that we have a good chance with this group of girls to win a MAC championship. Um, so I believe that this season is going to be tremendous for us, especially now that we have so many months to prepare for this season. I think this group of girls really has one of the best chances Iona's women's soccer has to win a MAC championship. And individually, I'm just looking to um, just add like a role to the team. I just want to be someone that, you know, has gone through four years of college soccer already and can give advice and just be a leader out there. Even though I am new, um, I know that as a freshman, I would want that. And so I'm hoping that I could just be a bigger part of the team in order to 
allow them to be successful. I just want to be a big role for them, um, whether it's on the field or off the field.